Are you guys cool moving forward post pandemic looking at a restaurant's menu on your phone with a QR code or do you actually want a menu? Well, I brought this up a few months back. Remember, I was like, can I have a menu? And they handed me the little, and how do you do? What, is, like, what is this? Oh, what do is this? this? What I do, do I do? Ask for a menu. What? 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 what is this square? What is this funny looking uh, square? Uh, oh, I, don't, I don't read this. Excuse what me. Is, I can't read it. What Excuse is that? Me. Excuse me? Well, how do I? Take a picture of it. Hold on uh, one second. Now what? Yeah. So <laughs> I just wanted fucking uh, it's how, it's how, chicken dip. It's how the rest of the world felt watching the Grammys last night. It's like, what is this? Huh? Who are these people? What are, <laughs> what's going on? Well, Camino, the QR code was supposed to be technology that took over the world like a decade ago and never really caught on. But I think I, I think mean, now in a paperless touch, uh, uh, you know, let's not touch things we don't need to world. I could see most restaurants saying, Hey, we can give you a menu if you want, but on the actual table or on a little piece of paper on the table, a lot of places have the QR code now where you just scan and you start scrolling the menu on your phone. I like and anything I'm, tangible. You know, I, I live in a world of I want the baseball card, not the NFT. You know what I mean? I want old right. school, bro. You're, yeah, you're an old guy. I'm you're an old, old guy. I'm nah. old school. I, I don't think I'm an I'm old guy, him. but I'm an old school. I was always always an old school guy, regardless. So I'm an extra old school guy. So I want the tangible thing, but because of the times we're living in, you know, safety first, I'm all about. I'm okay with it right now because you don't have to deal with someone else's sticky, shitty menu. Mm. I'm with they you. I think the menu, the I think the menu nowadays, the menu is one unnecessary thing I want to touch. I'm, I'm going to sit down at a table that they nicely wipe down. They're going to bring me food. It's an outdoor on a patio. Safe as could be. Right. Why, why would you want to throw a dirty fucking sticky menu into that mix? Health is wealth, bro. So if that's just one less thing to worry what about. What do I do? That's it. I want to see a menu that's lived. I want to see a menu that's... Spot. It lessens the uh, risk, right? Isn't that one thing we all tried to do for the past year? Lessen the risk, yeah. right? That's why we stayed six feet apart. That's why we only allowed... Uh, a third of the audience into the venue, whatever the fuck it was. You know, that's why you had to wait in line before you went in the store. You lessen the risk. So you don't give people menus if you don't have to. Simple. You don't need it. You don't need it. Hey, we're Cavino and Rich, and I hope you enjoyed that clip. I'm pretty sure you did. So if you did, leave a comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel at Covino and Rich. Now for our daily show and bonus content, make sure you join us at patreon.com slash Covino and Rich. Again, Patreon.com slash Covino and Rich. And tell your friends about it.